Hiya folks, it's Max from uh, GalaxyS2Root.com So I've got ROM of the week uh, After doing some soul searching on ROM searching for a little bit uh, I finally found a pretty good ROM for ROM of the week um, I know you, many of you are waiting for multi-window uh, But there are some very good uh, AOSP ROMs Such as this one um, I know AOKP has come a long way If you remember some of the newer Jelly Bean ROMs, they were not very uh, stable. But this one is very solid. Uh, AOKP MR1 Build 3. And the very, very fast out of the box. Um, you get the standard AOKP features, everything, Android 4.2.1. Very, very solid. Uh, general UI, you can do, you know, I went over this a bunch of times, but I'll go over it once more. Uh, for those of you who never tried this ROM, uh, show notification count um, that will you know show notification count for your Gmail Facebook and stuff when you get notifications uh, at the top and also transparency settings uh, back to kill kill all button I always put these on recent RAM bar because why not because when you hold down the home button you'll be able to see the RAM bar and kill all of your apps uh, just like a touch whiz uh, ROM and there we go also 180 degree rotation I would put that on for sure and uh, there is kind of a little fuzzing um, you can see there not a big deal it's not gonna affect uh, the way you use your phone at all and uh, battery clock signal status toggles this is where you can uh, change the toggles here um, there we go enable toggles you can enable I think up to uh, around 23 toggles NFC let's say and uh, if you want NFC at the top simply just uh, change the order here and also you can change the toggles per order here uh, if you want uh, let's say I want Wi-Fi first drag it up there and boom now you can get uh, with the standard uh, standard Android 4.2.1 you can only get maybe three three by three um, now with this one you can get almost five by six um, that's a lot of toggles I don't think you can even get that many toggles also fast toggle you can do one finger uh, for your notifications. You'll notice I was using two fingers. Um, with this enable, you can use one finger to the right side and get your toggles. Left side is your notifications. Pretty simple stuff. I'm not going to go over every one of these. Uh, but as you can see, you can get all of this in ROM control. And also, uh, one of the important ones is lock screen uh, with Android 4.2.1 AOKPMR1 build 3. You do get lock screen widgets, uh, allow all widgets, unlimited widgets. This will allow you to add any widgets where standard Android 4.2.1 does not allow you to add all of your widgets. This means you can go to the Play Store and download any of your favorite widgets um, and uh, be able to use them in your lock screen, which is the beauty of AOKP. AOKP is pretty much pioneer of, um, they pretty much invented the uh, lock screen. Android simply implemented with uh, their their latest Android 4.2.1 and 4.2.2, which is out already for Nexus devices, should be also coming in the next iteration of AOKP. Uh, also, performance control, you don't need to really use this unless you want to save a little battery life. Uh, pretty fair battery life on this one, you know, much better than previous versions, obviously. And I know I've got a lot of good feedback on AOKP ROMs uh, for this phone. And this is an official version, uh, which means it's officially supported by AOKP. It's not one of those ported versions uh, where we're going to find bugs here and there. This is pretty stable. MR1 stands for a stable version. Um, so you can't really go wrong with it, I don't think. Uh, there is no photosphere. There's actually no photosphere for any Android 4.2.1 ROMs unless you have a Galaxy Nexus device. Google locked it down. Uh, if you want Photosphere, you'll have to install like Android 4.1.2. Anything 4.1. something, um, you can actually grab a hacked uh, Google Apps and get Photosphere, but not on 4.2.1. So that's what happened. Um, so you know. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So for this week's ROM of the week, check out the latest AOKP. Very, very solid. Uh, if you've never tried AOKP type of ROMs, you'll should try it and also to note there is no um, Wi-Fi calling obviously because an AOKP ROM any kind of ROM that's built off Android sources such as this one 
Um, it's not going to have Wi-Fi calling. You'll need a TouchWiz based ROM um, because it's the binaries that's included in there. Uh, so check it out for this week's ROM of the week. Let me know what you think of the latest AOKP. I think you will definitely like it. Um, definitely, you know, very fast. Uh, no, you don't need overclocking. Much faster than TouchWiz. And uh, yeah, this is pretty solid. And do let me know what you think of this ROM. And if you have any uh, Galaxy S2, as always, don't forget to sign up for my email list at the Galaxy S2 route.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the week tips, hacks, and more. Uh, and also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me or subscribe button down there. And I'll see you guys soon. Uh, stay high on Android. Have a great uh, week. And uh, I think it's Happy Valentine's Day. So if you guys have uh, lovers, <laughs> go ahead and uh, um, maybe you can buy Android for them. <laughs> All right. See you guys later. Uh, happy V-Day and uh, stay high on Android.